hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to implement the search filter functionality into an HTML table using AngularJS I'm reloading the browser see here we got the text box control let's search the employee record the Verma we are see we got the employee details Verma if I remove we got back the whole table. If I enter Charan, we got the Charan details. Jack, Peter. That's it. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I am using Notepad. Now, in this new one page, I am adding a simple HTML code. HTML. I'm closing the HTML tag. Inside this HTML, I'm adding the header tags. After that, I'm adding the body tag. I'm closing the body tag. Now, inside this body, I'm adding center tag. I'm closing the center. H1. How to implement such filter functionality on HTML table in second header tag H2 I'm adding the label using AngularJS after that I'm adding horizontal now before adding the AngularJS functionality let's save this file angularjs search.htm page save and this is the output of that code which contains right now only header tags now let's add some data into a html table using angularjs after that we implement the search functionality so when you are using AngularJS, the first thing we require the latest AngularJS CDN link. For that search for AngularJS latest CDN. And from the search results, I'm selecting the first option Angular.js. Now in this website, you can find different versions of AngularJS, Angular, Angular 2 of CDN links. Now I'm using AngularJS, so I require the version is 1.5.11. After I selected the version, now I'm selecting the CDN link. This one, Angular.min.js. Just copy this CDN link, and I'm adding in the header section script source is equals to I'm pasting the CDN link and I'm closing the script tab after that I'm adding another script for angularjs inside this script I'm declaring a variable app is equals to angular.module now between these double quotes I'm adding the angular application name so after the body I'm adding a new due tag I'm closing the due tag after this center center tag ng iPhone app is an angular director my app is an application name let's copy this one and paste here comma adding now I'm adding the controller is a method the same do I'm adding ng iPhone controller direct to my controller let's add this controller also comma function dollar scope Now inside this function I'm adding some arrays 
dollar score dot emp details is equals to the employee details the first one is a emp name colon between single quotes charan comma email at gmail.com comma and salary is 15,000 is the first employee record comma the second one instead of writing again I'm just copying this part and paste here just I'm changing the employee details Jack the email id is jack at gmail.com and the salary is 12,000 and the last one Peter pet at gmail.com Salary is 12,000. Let's make it 11,000. Just for the demo purpose, I have added four employee details only. So let's close this one. That's it. We have added some employee details in this Angular application. Now let's bind that uh, AngularJS. After the horizontal line, I'm adding table border is equals to one. I'm closing the table tag. Inside this table, tr, I'm closing the tr, th, which are table headers. I have three columns employee name, email, and salary employee name Just copy this one email and salary the last header after that I'm adding another TR I'm closing the TR now in this tr i'm adding the director ng iphone repeat is equals to i'm adding the emp in the emp details the object name now let's bind these arrays into this table td i'm closing the td tag between double curly braces which is the angular expression I'm adding EMP this object dot the column name which is the EMP name paste here copy this one EMP dot the second column name is the email copy this one paste here the last one is a salary copy this one and paste here that's it we have binded the data this arrays into this table using angular.js now before implement the search functionality with a text box control let's save this file we'll check the output on the browser this amp details array is binded into this table or not i'm reloading the browser and here we got the output that arrays is binded into this table using angular.js now let's implement the search functionality first i will add one text box control after the horizontal line input type is equals to text let's add the enter employee name placeholder 
we have to name him. Now I am adding a most important directive which is ng iPhone model is equals to and this is the Android JS directive. We are doing double quotes. I am adding. I am giving the name for the model is search emp dot filtering the records based on the employee name emp name. I am adding the emp name column name. That's it. After that. In the ng repeat the tr, I'm adding the filter colon. I'm adding the search emp. I'm getting the details from the text box control. So search emp. That's it. Let's save this file. I'll check the final output on the browser. I'm reloading the browser. See here we got the text box control. Let's search the employee record, the Verma V E R C. We got the employee details Verma. If I remove, we got back the whole table. If I enter Charan, we got the Charan details. Jack, Peter. That's it.